Leonard Manuel played injured at the rivals camp stop in Orlando and looked great doing it. I mean, he still has the size and the speed uh, to be a standout wide receiver at the next level, and I think he'll do that wherever he lands. Uh, I think he's developed a lot over the last year and, and, and really looks great in the role. What can't Eric Gilbert do? 6'5", 255 pounds, runs a 40-yard dash, sub 4-6 seconds, shines at tight end, defensive end. The only question is, where will he end up? He's very talented, very versatile. Mikhail Sherman is a supremely athletic outside linebacker who does a great job rushing the passer and flies to the football regardless of where it is on the field. He really looks like he could be a game changer at the next level. McKinley Jackson, five-star defensive tackle, 2020 class out of Mississippi. As we say, country strong, very disruptive, can get penetration, can get into the backfield. He's not just a plugger. Not a space eater, but a playmaker. Zachary Evans is a guy who does everything at the running back position with uh, fluid motion, ease of motion, doesn't seem to be working that hard, but still gets separation from people, can catch the football as well. Uh, a very good runner with excellent vision, upright guy with good size, so obviously like him a lot. Miles Hinton, 2020 five-star offensive tackle, looks the part, plays the part. 6'6", six, six, around 310 pounds, good feet, good balance, long reach, could play right tackle or left tackle on the next level. There's a lot of talk that Savelle Smalls is one of the best players in Washington in at least the last decade, and it's easy to see why. He comes off the edge with a lot of violence. He's incredibly athletic, and he's a big-time playmaker at defensive end. He can also play that hybrid role at linebacker, which makes him so incredibly versatile. At six foot five, 280 pounds, five-star defensive lineman Brian Brzee has one of the fastest first steps that I've seen out of any defensive lineman. He's got a chance to push for one of those top two spots as this ranking cycle continues. Justin Flo is one of the best linebackers I've seen in many years, and it's hard to believe that he has two years of high school left. He's so physical, so strong, and he wants to go hit people all the time. He really is a fantastic player who plays sideline to sideline, plays downhill, and will knock your block off. Quarterback DJ Wagalele is their number one prospect in the class of 2020 for many different reasons. First of all, he looks like a college football player already. He's about six foot four, 225 pounds. Physically, you would you would actually believe that he's an NFL quarterback. That's how big he is. He's got a very strong arm. He's accurate. His footwork is excellent. Mechanics need a little bit of work, but not much. So this is a special prospect. And obviously, a quarterback position is a premium position. So he's number one for 2020.